Let's customize a career page in Team Taylor. Click on Content to go to your content editor. This is where you see an overview of all your content and can edit it. Choose to view this page as a grid or list. Hover over your career site and then click Edit. On your left side, you can see the content of your career site structured in what we call blocks. These blocks are the foundation of your career site. You can drag and drop these blocks to change the structure of your site. Edit the blocks by clicking on them. To add blocks, click on the big pink plus button here. Add your company values with an easy to read layout or add a timeline to mark important events throughout your company's journey. If you often get similar questions from visitors to your site, add an FAQ block to address them, or boost interaction on a specific part of your site by adding a call to action. Show and hide blocks from your career site by clicking on these three dots and switching the toggle on or off. On the right, you can view what your site will look like. The view updates as you make changes. To start off with, enter your header block to add a logo. Then, go to Cover to add your header text, cover picture, and cover video if you have one. We recommend uploading both if possible. That way, your career site will choose which one works best depending on what device your viewer is using. A global block means that the content of this block will automatically appear if you add this block to other pages on your career site. For example, if you want your company culture block to have the same content in every place it appears on your site, flip the global toggle on. Now, when you add this block to your campaign page, the content is already in the block. On the bottom left, you can see a few base functions. Click on Responsive Mode to see the layout of your site depending on what device is being used – desktop, mobile, or tablet. Click on the pencil in the right-hand corner to change the design of the specific block you're working on. In this case, change the design of your header to full screen or our standard design. To customize your global design, that is, the base design of your career site, click on the pencil in the Base Function tab. Here you can change your primary color that will be used throughout your site, as well as typography. Mark the box Custom Fonts and import your company font if you'd like your career site to match your company's branding. You can also customize your global design with JavaScript or CSS. Once you've decided what departments to organize your company into and added the locations you're recruiting in, you can display them here. Drag and drop them into the position of your choice. We suggest showing the departments that you are hiring for most actively. The departments that will show are always the first three from the top. To edit the content on your department pages, simply go to your Content Editor home screen here. You'll see your department pages and can click on them to edit them in the exact same way as you do your career site. Click on Social Widgets to connect your page to your social media accounts. Adding a gallery is always an effective way to attract candidates. To add pictures, simply upload them by pressing the plus button. Once you have uploaded a picture into Team Taylor, it stays in your own Team Taylor photo library and is accessible to your entire team. This means you only have to upload a picture once. You can also use Team Taylor's integration with Unsplash to access a free photo library. If you have HTML or CSS skills, you can add blocks to code your own design in the blocks. Add as many self-customized blocks as you want. If you decide to change something within the code in that block, only that specific block is affected, rather than altering your entire site. There's so much you can do in the content editor. We've got an in-house specialist who knows all things content, so just let us know if you have any more questions and we'd be happy to help you out. Bye for now!